Here we presents the top 5 best garage heater. Starting of our listed number 5. Mr. Heater MH25 LP. Many garage heater buyers out there will need the option to mount their unit on the wall, and the third garage heater on our list of the 10 best gives you precisely that option. It's the Mr. Heater MH25 LP garage heater, and this unit proves that sometimes, very good things actually do come in smaller packages. This heater is a pretty simple and straightforward piece of equipment, and that will be a big plus for users who don't need bells and whistles and just want to heat a space with as little fuss as possible. The heater sits on a no-nonsense bracket that is easy to install, and will quietly do a job, while you do yours, if you intend to mount this garage heater in a workshop area. The Mr. Heater MH25 LP boasts a huge BTU rating that amounts to 25,000 units of heating power, and this thing will quickly raise the temperature in any area. The Mr. Heater MH25 LP burns propane gas and works as a radiant heater, so there is no fan mechanism to fail, and you can also expect quiet operation, this is an excellent heater for use where noise might be an issue or if your garage is situated within the main structure of your home. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. Coming in at number 4 of our list. King GH2405 TB240. The King Electric is an all-black adjustable garage heater that comes with a built-in fan to control the intensity of the heat being generated. It can regulate temperature and has no thermostat alongside the former controls just mentioned. Mounting is made into a simple task with the bracket. It should sit well on most walls and ceilings. Those made from sheetrock and plywood are the best. Even with just 5000 watts of power, this machine works like a charm in getting small to medium-sized rooms warm. Those with insulation will be better but even a garage without it shouldn't run into too many problems, though it may take a little while longer for heat to overpower cool air from outdoors. Upon inspection, you'll notice that coils are lined on the rear of the fan. This is where it drives heat. It's not as powerful as propane or natural gas, however. Being that this is electric, everything must be hardwired before it's used. Halfway of our listed number 3. Modine HD 45 s 111 Last but not least is the Modine, a natural gas propane heater that's housed in a gray exterior box. It's safe to use in an indoor garage setting and is able to produce heat over a large floor space. You'll probably set it up near a ceiling, any garages that are higher than average in size should be well heated with its strong airflow emissions. While propane is an option, you'll need to have it converted in order to do so. The natural gas connections also require thorough installation to be completed before anything is activated. Its efficiency is listed as 80%, which means that 20% of your electricity's past cost will now come out of the exhaust. Speaking of exhaust, the unit does not include it in the packaging. Out of all the products reviewed on the list, this one carries with it the most need for a professional install. Number 2 of this list. Heatster by Enerco F125444. If you're not keen on needing a heater that blows the air in a certain direction, then the Heatstar is another good choice for your garage. It does this with natural gas. If you're also a lover of electrics that tend to keep the noise level to a minimum, you'll surely love how effective this product is a heating room without the direction of any moving parts. Much like the first product reviewed, installation is pretty straightforward assuming that you have a natural gas connection. If not, you could either pass up and try out something else or go through the trouble of getting it placed in your garage. Estimate your fuel's costs versus how much you would save if this was installed. In some cases, the savings might not be significant enough to warrant a natural gas heater at all. And your garage's size could be a determining factor as well. But even then, this heater's use could double as an alternative for other means such as in a barn for animals and livestock. And coming in at number 1 of our list, Dr. Heater DR966. There's an adjustable thermostat for you to change the heat intensity to a high or low setting, along with inserts immediately outside on the interior that must be turned manually to adjust the direction of fan heat. Garage heaters that run off electricity are oftentimes easier to set up requiring no professional installation. Just be sure to read through the instruction manual to double check that your setup includes the proper wiring, which lists an 8-2 and 32 amp breaker. 
You probably would be able to get away with a 10 slash 3 on 30 amp breaker but this isn't specified in the pamphlet provided, which could result in the unlikely event of voiding your warranty. What size room is it best for? You might have trouble heating up rooms that are large, however. This issue is increased if you would prefer to use in the low setting, which is about 3000 watts. Heat at the 6000 watt level is fine but anything other than running it at the highest setting won't have a noticeable effect especially in climates that stay frigid for most of the day in the winter. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. Thank you for watching, please subscribe our channel, share this video and hit the like button.